The following contest is a special guest referee match. And it's for the WWE Women's Championship. All right, time to lay down the law. Yeah, right. Please welcome the special guest referee for this match, Bailey. So how many missed calls and overlooked infractions do you think we should expect here? No, oh, would you listen to yourself? You're being ridiculous. Our guest referee is a pro. She'll catch everything. I'm going to guess like five. Put me down for three. Oh, you too, Cole? When they're calling the shots and deciding what flies in the ring, I think we can safely assume this will be a very interesting match. And a fair one. Don't forget fair. It's a big-time opportunity, Byron, as the title will be on the line here. You're right, Michael, and judging from the response on social media heading into this match, we're likely to see a new champ crowned here tonight. The challenger is all business. She's been training harder than ever for this title opportunity. A woman who's flattened everything in her path, Nia Jax. One of the most dominant women in WWE history. Physically unparalleled in the women's division, Nia Jax has imposed her will on everyone that stepped in the ring as opposition. An incredible pedigree for success for Nia Jax. Taking one final look at the title. WWE Universe anxiously awaiting the sound of the bell. Should be a hell of a match. Every 
woman wants it, few get the distinction of holding it. This match is for the WWE Women's Championship. The prestige goes into the pin. She breaks the count quick. And our guest referee counting the pin right down the line. Give the ref credit. That's a fair count. <laughs> oh, brutal. Just breaking down the opponent. Great counter. She will wisely return to the ring now. Looking for more damage here. Release back suplex. Ouch. Was definitely not thinking about finesse with that one. Was only thinking about dominance. Made her pay for her mistake. Set up in the corner of the ring. Running hip attack. What impact. Covered by the champ. Gets the shoulder up in one. Standard pin count from her there. Consistency with the cadence. You can't say she wasn't impartial. She left herself open. Brutal face buster. Nia Jax would be the first to admit that she has a lot of, let's say, self-confidence when competing due to her size and power advantages. Do you think that confidence will play a factor here tonight? Of course it will. Cole always does. But for it to play a positive factor for Nia, she has to balance that well-earned self-confidence with those size and power advantages you mentioned. By my calculations, confidence plus skill equals success. And guys, she's dangerously close to a count-out loss. Returning to the ring now. Gotta find a way to get out of this. Lands face first. A striking blow. The challenger eating up some damage. Jax might have just made a big opportunity for herself. The middle rope. What a roundhouse kick. Big leg drop. Might just have the quickness advantage over the champ. That could factor into this in a very big way when push comes to shove. It misses on the springboard. This is not going to be good. Relentless. Nothing was being held back with each of those strikes. She shoots up the top rope. Dangerous thinking. Oh boy, that's a determined stare that's come across her face. Here we go. Diving hammer strike. Shoulders down now. Is it enough to retain the championship? Stays in the fight for the title. Good job by the ref seeing the kick out right away. One of the more fair counts I've seen. Can't complain about the officiating there. Just disrespectful. Just absolute disrespect from the champion. Hoping to send a message to the whole locker room. Using the cranium. Now pick up your teeth and go home. Isolating the foot. DDT on the foot. Nice takedown. Basement drop kick. The champ not looking great right now. Yeah, but you can't count anyone out yet. This match could still go either way. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. Nia's getting picked apart here. Nia needs to find that irresistible force once more. She sent flying into the corner. And the referee was right there with a proper count. With this much at stake, she's taking her officiating duties very seriously. Just stretching out the arm. The wear and tear on the champion's shoulder is going to be something to watch as this title match goes on. Nia Jax brushes that one off.
Oh, yeah. She is really getting fired up. If a shortcut presents itself, you better take it. The challenger is not in from the middle rope. Oh, she misses the mark. Ooh, what a four club. Oh, did you hear that? And set right into the corner. Textbook scoop slam. Nicely done. Down, glam slam, free fall. Sidewalk slam. That's gotta be it. There's two. Solid work by our special referee. Our official showing she's a professional of the highest order. Oh, stop to the belly, Welly. This is just punishing, disrespectful. Oh, definitely hurts. Nia is lighting up her opponent. And Nia Jax with a clear advantage. I think we're about to see it. Muscles him all the way up. Powerball. But champions need to finish the job. Two. With that, Nia Jax continues her reign. Here is your winner. And still, the WWE Women's Champion, Nia Jax. She still holds the gold. She knew to cement yourself as a true champion, you have to defend it. You have to become battle-tested. And that is exactly what she did tonight.